Corday, and I am so excited to present this over six million dollar French inspired custom house to you. Guys, there's so much I want to show you. Let's go inside and have a look. Hi, Sana. Hi, Irina. How are you? I'm good. How are you? Good to see you. Thank you, guys. It's a special treat today because we have Irina, the listing agent for this property, here with us. But I think she has to run. But I really wanted to introduce you to her. So thank you, Sana. Welcome to Six Metri Road. Thank Please you. Please enjoy. Thank you. We're gonna have a lot of fun together. So I'm standing in the formal living room. There is a lot of rooms to go through. So this is the first one located just by the front entrance. And one of the special features is the ceiling height. Guys, we have 10 feet of living space here and that just automatically opens up the room and makes it feel that much more airy. Now I want to point something out to you. I know you guys are so used to seeing my stagings in the property that I tour but not this one this one was done by another company they did a fantastic job and the house just stood out to me so much that I contacted Irina and I thought I got to show this to my viewers did you catch the ceiling height yes it's very grand, isn't it? I do agree with you, and that's what makes this property special because we don't have a lot of homes that we tour or stage that have this grand foyer area, and that, my friends, makes it stand out. So something I wanna tell you, I'm kind of standing between the living room and the dining room area, but I have this really nice hallway here and what i love about it is it creates so much privacy for the family in here you have your powder room you have your office and you have a mud room so maybe areas that you really don't want to expose as much so what do you do when you have a 7,000 square foot home you create a privacy area with all of those rooms in it let's continue our tour are you guys hungry well step inside our formal dining room this room is fully set up for us and I'm just waiting for the chef to come by. So this formal dining room is seating eight seats right now, but it can easily accommodate eight, 10, or maybe even 12 because it's that grand. And take notes, all you transitional lovers, because we have wainscoting. Wainscoting is a beautiful feature to add to your space if you want to add a little bit more luxury. So let's go on and see what's on the other side of the house. So this is what I talk about when I speak of indoor outdoor space. When you don't really have that outdoor space coming in, you create it. How? With beautiful windows, of course, with adding a couple skylights. Guys, this is the perfect breakfast area. I can just imagine it's gorgeous during the day, but it's even better at nighttime. You kind of feel like you're outside. I love this nook. I would be spending all my time here. Just saying. This kitchen, as you can see, is very traditional very French inspired and I see it throughout all of the finishes the cabinetry all of the detailing done in the glass the colors they've picked for all of the cabinets the countertop beautiful island oversized and guess what you have beautiful appliances now some ideas on how to really customize your kitchen and I see it here on our wall is they've created this pantry wall where so much storage I mean check these out you have all this cabinet space to store in all of your supplies that you don't want to be exposed and plus all-time favorite guys paneled fridge and freezer but really do you actually see how much of a difference it makes when you don't see the fridge and freezer exposed nobody wants to see that if you have the budget for it hide it please <laughs> so when you're talking about a house that has six bedrooms and five bathrooms you better be sure to have ample amount of seating space 
and this house definitely covers all those things because this is the family room area but it's so oversized that you feel like you can entertain so many people in here and what I love most about it is the open concept space between the family room and the kitchen area so when you're on this side doing cooking or whatever you're actually included in what's happening on this side of the room and that brings togetherness and warmth to this space so definitely consider that if you're renovating or building a house consider opening up the rooms and joining them together just with small details it's all you need sometimes so if you guys think that I've shown you some pretty special features you haven't seen anything yet because I promise you you do not want to miss this primary bedroom let's go and have a look the most elegant rooms that I have ever seen. Guys, this space is actually even more beautiful standing in it than I'm sure in the video. But even in the video, look at this view. Look at this gorgeous window. The way that everything is designed here is perfection. I would never want to leave this room. You have all of this green space. You have the little Juliet balcony, which is absolute perfection. And then you have this very spacious bedroom and the ceiling height. I mean, can it get better than this? Not really. They have a king size bed two nightstands, a few different seating areas in this space and it all works so well together but everything is kind of pointing towards this direction because when you come in through that hallway it's one of those moments where it takes your breath and you're like oh my goodness I bet you got the little same kind of feeling when you saw us show this view too a truly elegant primary ensuite. Let me tell you, there's so many beautiful details in this primary ensuite, from the choice of cabinetry and the finishes to the stone tiles on the floor and the little marble inlays kind of going around to give it that beautiful design, all the way to this beautiful window just behind me that is so eye-catching as soon as you walk in you see it with of course the weeping willow tree just behind it from the view to the finishes this is definitely a luxury primary ensuite and we finally make it outside guys I have been looking at this view from inside this whole time just wanting to see what's going on out here beautiful landscaping beautiful gardening such a precious land property this house is sitting on I mean look at the grandness of this house I want to thank Irina first of all for giving us the opportunity to do this home tour and present this beautiful property to you guys but at the same time I want to thank you guys for joining us this was a pretty special house and I hope you agree but I want to hear something What's your favorite feature of this property? Guys, like the video like always, comment below, and subscribe to our channel. And if you haven't already, check us out on Instagram at Style with Sanas. And we'll see you at the next home tour. I'm going to go check around and see what else is going on in this chateau.